good morning everyone uh, welcome to science tutor video lectures uh, this morning we'll be covering the introduction to biology all right the first question to be answered what is biology biology is the study of the interaction of abiotic factors as well as biotic factors All right. biotic factors refers to anything that is living while abiotic factors refers to anything that is non-living it is the interaction of living and non-living things that allows life to exist as we know it so uh, just a list of biotic factors biotic factors include as you can see all animals all trees plants bacteria we have a fungus or fungi to be plural protists mm. yeah so basically all living thing include as I say all animal plants trees bacteria fungus oh and algae all right and for abiotic factors that include anything that is non-living and these factors are a necessity for all living things to exist which is why it's important to study both biotic and abiotic factor abiotic factor include sunlight which um, without you can have no photosynthesis we have air and to make it more specific gases that are useful such as carbon dioxide oxygen carbon dioxide is used to make glucose and oxygen is used in aerobic respiration other gases that may be of importance include nitrates okay um, other than sunlight air we also have habitat or living space all right you have water okay soil yes without soil you cannot grow any plant okay minerals all right so basically in a nutshell biology is a study of the interaction of abiotic factors which are non-living and biotic factors which are living um, as you can see a list of the biotic factors everything that is living all living organism from trees plants bacteria fungus protists algae and non-living which include sunlight air habitat our uh, living space water soil minerals vitamin all right it's important to understand these factors because it is it is the interaction of these factors that allow organism to succeed or to yes to succeed uh, to um, reproduce and basically continue life as is so it is the interaction of these factors that allow life to exist without these factors life would seek to exist and therefore it is important for the success uh, reproduction and continuation of life thank you